What's good everybody, it's H back with another 12 TV video and today I'm looking at a very dope shoe. Uh, I'm not, I'm, I'm kind of slowly trying to get into buying more Air Force Ones but there's only been a few that have you know kind of kind of hit me and, and, and said yeah this is, this is what I like. Uh, but nah I mean like this one's sort of a basic one but very dope at the same time. It's the um, Happy Pineapple Air Force One. Let's get into it. So, Air Force Ones come in these boxes. There's two different boxes, a black one. I think it's for the special editions. This is this a special edition? No. Hmm. I don't know. But there's a black one and there's a gray one. And the gray one tends to be I think I think the gray one's for the special editions, to be honest with you. I because I've I have more like special edition, more premium ones, like the experimentals, the Colin Kaepernick's came in a gray one. Uh, the Kith ones came in a gray one. So I think that is more so for the special edition type of Air Force One. This might be just a basic box of black. I like the black, it's cool, it is what it is. These here, though, are interesting. Boom, it is the Happy Pineapple joints. I love the way they did the coconut milk colorway on there and uh, Tyler Gold, Latte Coca, all that stuff. Just just dope little, little extras that Nike does, creating its own colors to complement the colorway. I like the coconut milk, goes with the pineapple, you know, all the tropical fruits and stuff. So yeah, basic Air Force One box. Getting into it, all the paper. Interesting thing about paper in Air Force One boxes, it's kind of granulated with the little stars that are on the toe, which is a nice little accent, so they all do that. So just pushing this off, let's get into these. Most especially in the box, but an amazing shoe so these are them all right they consist mainly of canvas and recycled materials here this is more of a this is all recycled right here this stuff right here and the check mark is recycled and I think that's oh yeah it has a cork cork insole I'm not gonna pull it out but it is a cork insole and it fits standard, like your standard Air Force One. Air Force Ones don't really differentiate from the norm when it comes to uh, fit. Oh yeah, and the sole. Whew. What's cool about it? so this cork? So it's like a cork sole. Like, let me get that in focus, focus, fool, focus, man, focus. Look at that cork. It's beautiful. Very beautiful cork sole. They have an old cork version of the Happy Pineapple, too. Uh, I think that came out a while ago, or, or first. Canvas all around, which I don't particularly care for canvas shoes, but it is what it is with these. I had to get them, they're beautiful, all right? Got that, like that teal or turquoise, I guess, type of like um, lining around the check, which I like to an extent, gives it that tropical feel, but at the end of the day, it's gonna be hard to match up. That's the only accent on here, so that's that. And of course, you have your Happy Pineapple, which is the first thing that drew me into this bad boy. Yeah. <laughs> and on the back, your standards, your Nike Air, and a nice little cork, little, little accent piece there uh, for the like, tab, pull tab in the back. Very clean, very clean colorway. I really mess with it. I'm always trying to, you know, figure out different ways to get an Air Force One on my feet. I really like the aesthetic. They're fairly comfortable. These are pretty lightweight, uh, considering that they are made out of recycled materials. And I think out of all of them, they have an Air Max 95 that's cork as well, which I'm, I mean, I'm a happy pineapple, which I think we're going to cop to because those are pretty dope. And, um, yeah, I mean, that's just it. I had to get these. I saw them. 
obviously they're still sitting on Nike. I think the Nike Ni Air Max 95s are still sitting out there. I'm gonna have to cop those and do a video. But yeah, this brown on the bottom, man, that cork brown that, with that that cork. This is all recycled material, so it's all sustainability. That's what this Happy Pineapple stuff's all about. They just try to come out with these different things. They did like Air Max One um, daisies last year, for no reason, or two years ago. I don't know. I got those too. Those are dope too. I had a little daisy on the side. Just a little subtle thing to make it a little different. And it has like the hits of the color of the flower or the plant or the or the fruit in this case all over the shoe. But these are dope. They're just different. Different materials on it. Got canvas, recycled material. I wish the whole shoe was just kind of... I wish this stuff was canvas and this was the recycled material. Just because I hate the way canvas creases and gets dirty. But I'm going to shoot spray it down with some, uh, spray it down with some rejuvenator and all that. Oh, this is dope. I just noticed it. this was on the other one as well. Can you focus in on that? Look at that. It says product of Beaverton, I think, on there. Uh, yeah. Product of Beaverton and some some serial number. Can't really see it. Eh, there it is. Eh, stop. Focus. You know, something wrong with my camera, yo. I don't know. Either way, that's dope. Tell me what you think about these. It's an Air Force One. Air Force One's a pretty commonplace. You know what I'm saying? I don't really care for it that much, but I had to get these. I mean, the Air Force One model itself, but I had to get these because they were just dope. And, you know, at the 130 premium price, I don't know. I mean, is it worth, I think, Air Force One's range for like 90 bucks? I think they're 90 at the end of the day. Uh, but the extra 40 to get a happy pineapple, I ain't mad at it. And I got it for retail. And it's authentic, so I'm happy about that. So like and subscribe, tell us what you think. Check out the podcast. We we had a great one this past week. A very heated argument about um, the socioeconomics of sneakers. Ran for two hours. So link down below for all that. And just check out all the videos. Yeah, we got a lot of stuff coming. And we'll see you all later. Peace. Thank you.